good day to you munchkins and my god does it feel good to say that first time in about two years sorry i was a little bit busy dealing with existential dread and you know the reality of becoming an adult but i'm back now to remedy that with making stupid internet videos one thing about becoming an adult that I've realised is uh, your boy's not very good at making decisions. Pretty bad at it, actually. So, I'm taking positive steps to fix that by using the internet. I, of course, did the only rational thing and headed to Reddit, the fountain of all YouTube content nowadays. And I'm going to tackle my issues with decision making by answering hypothetical would you rather questions. It's a little bit Harvey Dent in the way I'm trying to fix it but it worked for him a little, kind of. My turn. So without further ado, answer some stupid questions. Would you rather not be able to answer questions or not be able to ask questions? Shit. Not being able to answer questions would really fuck up my academia, but equally would so would not being able to ask them, because I don't know much. I have to ask a lot. Oh, and if I can't answer questions, then I can't seem smart. I don't like seeming smart. I'm really good at pretending to be. Uh, I'm gonna go with ask questions, because I can still find stuff out, I just can't ask people about it. And answering questions, making people think that I'm actually intelligent, will be good for my self-esteem. Yeah? Well, no, I'd clearly suck. I'm asking you for confirmation. I'd, I'd need to be able to ask questions. Fuck! Would you rather never watch movies again, or have every scene you watch spoiled? Mmm, I do hate spoilers, but I do like films. Yeah, I'll go with the spoiled, because if it's a good enough film, spoilers don't matter. I had Fight Club spoiled for me. I was fucking livid. But it's still a great film. Yeah, fuck you and your spoilers. Don't spoil things. Please don't spoil every film I <laughs> intend to watch in the future. Would you rather be a fat teenager and get fit as an adult, or be a fit teenager and get fat as an adult? I feel like being fat as a teenager is going to do less damage to my body overall. And then you get that whole redemption story, don't you? They make a film about me. Yeah, be a fat teenager. Screw the ridicule. That won't emotionally scar me for life. Being a fat teenager wouldn't be an issue if people weren't such douches in high school. Just saying. Would you rather poop in the only toilet at a party knowing that you'll clog it, or poop in the bushes in the backyard? Please hurry. Oh, that person was actually looking for advice. I hope you chose wisely. Would you rather have a child made of pee, or a pee made of child? So surely it'd be like, pureed child, not like, whole child? That'd be like passing a hell of a kidney stone. Or, you know, giving birth. Oh, nah, urethras are not big enough for that. I never thought I'd actually have to deeply consider a question like this so much. And this child made of pee, is it literally just a jar? Like a sentient jar of pee? Or is it like some sort of fluid entity, baby-shaped, Thing. Could you pick her up? Or is it like frozen pee? I think the child made of pee, maybe. Is it smelly pee? Could I perfume the child to not smell like pee? I have so many questions. No, no, child made of pee. I don't want the exit of, no, no. I don't want to urinate a kid. Would you rather have $10,000 transferred to your bank account daily or eat both of your hands? Am I missing something? Gonna go for the 10 grand. Is eating your hands fun? I'm not gonna try it to find out. Would you rather be the smartest person in the world or the stupidest person in the world? In both scenarios, you have the same level of intelligence you have now. Oh, I don't like feeling stupid though. Ah, uh, how self-centered am I? Nah, surely I'd, I'd prefer to be the dumbest person in the world because I'm not that stupid. So if everybody else is only more intelligent, then the human race is going to be alright. If everyone's dumber, because I know I am not smart enough to be the smartest person in the world. You know, important as that would make me feel, 
I cannot deal with stupid people. No, I'm going to be the dumbest person in the world because if everybody else is better, then we're fine. And I can just I'll leech off their success. I'll they do the hard work. I'll watch all those movies that are getting spoiled for me. Would you rather there be a ding sound every time you wink or have a cartoonish gun sound go off when you make a finger gun? Hmm. Okay, wait. Post-production magic. Which of those was cooler? I don't know. Ooh, but the finger gun thing. Ah, oh, you'd be like the alpha dad. I don't wink very often. I feel like I can't, like, convincingly wink at people. I think I'll probably just look creepy or like I've got a bit of a twitch. Why can't I do both? Like a bit of a... Told you I was bad at making decisions. I'm gonna go with the wink because I'd, I'd get in trouble if I kept doing this and it was making gun noises. Too dangerous. I'm going for the wink. Would you rather be forced to say m'lady every time you address a woman or yell I'm an atheist as loud as possible every time someone says God bless you? Ooh. I think I'd look mighty fine in a fedora to be fair. But pretty funny shouting that you're an atheist. I probably shouldn't say that. I was raised Catholic. Hmm. No one says God bless you though. So would that even come up? No, I'm gonna go with the I'm an atheist just because I think that'd be funnier. I'd like to feign outrage. Like one of my favourite things to do. If you ever see me in public, you know what to do. Would you rather have free unlimited Starbucks for the rest of your life or always have your phone or laptop charged to 100% without ever having to charge it for the rest of your life? I'm going to cheat this one because I'm going to go with the Starbucks because everyone knows in Starbucks you've got chargers, there's power outlet wall plug things, where else is everyone going to write their screenplays? So I'm going to go and basically live in Starbucks, they've got coffee, they've got food, I'll be probably diabetic and incredibly overweight after a couple of weeks, but everything I own will be charged, checkmate Reddit. Would you rather get paid $500 every time you make someone laugh or $10,000 every time you make someone cry? Laugh. Hands down laugh. I'm f making people cry. That's not what I'm about. You just think you've only got to make like 20 people chuckle and then you made the same amount of money. And think of, think of the, the spiritual reward. Take the moral high ground. F the money. Just make people laugh. Wholesome. Huh? Would you rather have to listen to your least favourite music for the rest of your life? I'll have to say the you from Crank That by Soldier Boy every time you say the word you. you. Crank that song, now what? I mean you. Crank that song, now what? Soldier Boy Crank That all day. Hell yeah. I might just adopt that in my everyday life, but easily I'd rather do that than have to like listen to ABBA constantly. Hmm, uh, no. Soldier Boy every day. Would you rather become a sentient strawberry with the mind you have now, but no physical ability for mobility or communication, or just become a regular strawberry with strawberry thoughts? I just want to be a strawberry. Why would you want to be a sentient strawberry? That would be your own personal hell. You're just stuck on a, on a bush. Strawberries grow on bushes? Trees? Plants? You're just there. Strawberry plant. You can't do anything. Why would you want this? Oh, then you're just waiting to be eaten. Nah, I want the ignorant bliss of being a strawberry. Thank you very much. Would you rather be able to hold bananas in your hands like guns and say pew pew and shoot lasers out of them or be able to throw oranges and have them act like target seeking missiles? That is a toughie. I do love a good Ah, <laughs> oh, but target seeking missiles, think of the utility. Yeah, I don't trust my ability to aim enough. I'm going for the oranges. Plus, I think that'd just be funnier. Orange following someone as they run around the corner. Yeah, oranges. Would it specifically have to be oranges? Or could it be any kind of citrusy fruit? It's like a satsuma, they're just all that little bit smaller, you could carry more. Thinking about this too much. Would you rather be able to transform into a blueberry at will, or have blueberries whisper to you and tell you secrets about the universe that no one will ever believe. Why is it so fruit themed? Where's the utility in transforming into a blueberry? Again, then you're just a danger of being eaten. Or am I a human sized blueberry? Ooh, 
That could change things. It didn't specify, so I have to assume it's just regular blueberry. No, we have blueberries in the house too often. I'm not risking getting eaten. I'm gonna whisper to blueberries, hell yeah, I wanna know the secrets of the universe. I don't care if no one believes me. Oh, just think how wise I'd feel. Would you rather be able to control fire or water? Mmm, I've watched too much Avatar to be able to think this through logically. I like fire. Fire is fun. I'm trying to sound a little less pyromanic when I say that. But yeah, fire is awesome. But water is very useful and bloodbending. I feel like there'd be much more use in manipulating water. I could put fires out, be your own personal fire fighter, dude. Uh, water. No, f mm, yes. Water. Yeah. Would you rather have hands that kept growing as you got older, or feet that kept growing as you got older? How quickly do they grow? Either way, you'd end up with some pretty big appendages. How inconvenient would big hands be? Probably about as inconvenient as big feet. Buying shoes would be a nightmare though. It's already annoying enough. I'm gonna go with the big hands, then just think of all the stuff you could carry. Oh, you could be like the world's greatest goalkeeper. Screw it, big hands, you just give awesome high fives. Would you rather give up bathing for a month or give up the internet for a month? Give up the internet. I'm not feeling gross for a month. I feel weird if I don't shower every day, never mind after a month. Oh, just thinking about that. No, screw the internet. So I don't, no, I don't mean it like that. I'm sorry. Okay? I need to feel clean. Would you rather have a Lamborghini in your garage or a bookcase with 9,000 books and infinite knowledge? Books. Would you rather know how you will die or when you will die? Oh, what kind of fresh hell that would be either way. I'd rather know how. No, I wouldn't. I'd rather know when, but no, I'd... God damn this f***ing game. I'd rather know when. Yes, no, when, yes, when. Because that way, you can get all your shit done and then just be fine with it. But if you only know how, then you're gonna crap yourself every time you see an angry looking poodle because someone says you're gonna get mauled by one. And that might not even be the time. Then you'd be prejudiced against poodles. Ah, the ultimate question. Would you rather fight 100 duck-sized horses, or one horse-sized duck. A hundred's a lot, but they're only duck-sized. A horse-sized duck? That'd probably eat me. I'm gonna go for the hundred duck-sized horses, because they're, they're like ankle height, you just kick them, I guess. And I'd kick her, sir. Brush them, get a broom. Just shift them into a corner, you're fine. Befriend one of them, keep it as a pet. You've got a lovely little, like a teacup horse. Aww. I want a teacup horse. And thus concludes me trying to answer questions and make decisions. Don't feel any better for it. Think I made all the wrong choices. Hopefully you found that enjoyable. Let me know how you'd answer some of the questions. Some of them were good. Some of them were fucking terrible. And why not drop some of your favourite would you rathers in the comments and let me agonise over how to answer them. God knows I need the practice. Thank you very much for joining me. It's a pleasure being back. Hope you're good. And the thing, and the bye, and the see you whenever. Mwah. This video better look fucking good. I've got lights and shit and fucking... It took me like 20 minutes doing that. Because I'm incompetent.